Okay, I came up with an idea and I ordered some uh, some of these types of uh, lithium-ion 18650 battery holders and uh, I tried it and it fits inside there and then so does this and this so very excited here we go first off when you make something like this you want to want to get the bottom taped with some electrical tape Start at one edge, put it down, then push it into the corners. The overlap is not bad, not a bad idea. Overlap a little bit. And Move it in there. It's a cool tin too. It's kind of, I don't know if that's rare. I haven't seen them since I bought this and then, because I've never seen it before and then I've never seen them again. At this point I would go to the other edge here. To be, I guess. Try not to make giant long videos that are drawn out and stuff. This is probably gonna be the longest video I've ever had on my channel. Is that actually doing a how-to? I almost started making this without making a video, and then I, I had to stop myself and set up the phone to take take the video and to get everything going so that everybody could see how awkward I am. <laughs> How uncoordinated. There, yeah, good enough. Alright, bottom's taped up. Next step is to mark where stuff's gonna be. I'm gonna be able to, I wanna have access to this button here. I do wanna get this off up a little bit higher so the button's easier to get, and because I want it to have this, uh, but I don't want it to be to interfere with this, so it's gonna have to be just below that. So I think what I'll do is do like this on the outside and mark it, but then I'll drill a hole and then maybe cut it. I have some scissors that cut this kind of material. Anyway, let me get set up on that. Okay, I got my so drill here. These are those scissors that you can cut a penny with, and I think I did once, and then they've never been the same. So, if you get a pair like this, don't cut a penny with them. Be patient, take small bites here. And you can open the hole up, but you can't make it smaller. get a bigger drill to make the, the hole for the LED to poke through. That's huge. Okay, I checked the uh, hole and it still has to be bigger anyway, so let's get back to it. nice that it didn't I caught it before it slammed into the other side so the hole looks really nice and uh, let's see how the bulb fits it's perfect so now I just got to chew out the other side here which I already started doing a little bit I was having a problem with the uh, memory on my phone of course it's running out of memory so I deleted some other stuff that I don't need but I'm gonna, I'm gonna shape this into a hole that this will just fit inside of with along with this so hopefully 
I'll come back and not have something that's too mangled. I'll be right back. That's why I'm not making you listen to this part. Again, like I was saying, I wanted to keep this up off the bottom here so it was higher up. So the, that, the, uh, that the switch was easier to get to. And this. Okay, I'll make I'll I'll save you from that noise. Okay, the hole's now to the point where I just need to make it just a little little bit bigger. So I'm gonna snip that. It's right up on the edge. Okay, I got it to the point where I got this in there. See, it's in. Now I'm just gonna get it to the edge like this. Or so, and then I'll solder it in. I'll put so some solder on the inside right here and across the top there to hold it in place. And then, uh, I've done that before. That worked really good. And then I gotta cut a hole for this. Somewhere over here. Now I gotta make a hole for this. Um, and then bring the two together. That should work out pretty good. Is the size? It's it's pretty good. Okay, and then stuff this in. Get it to look a little bit square. Okay, see it doesn't line up quite so good, so I gotta sand this down on the floor more. I can, once I get some, some, uh, glue underneath there it'll probably line up a lot better you know what I'll do is uh, I'll say I'll get this uh, file down some here but then I'm gonna put this through plug it in and then to something and then have it that'll hold it in place while I put a bunch of glue underneath plug it in hold it and then push down and hold it there while the glue dries you okay, will call that the end of part one this was uh, how to make the box and uh, next will be the wiring for part two. Thank you.